What's going on guys? Happy, happy Thursday morning. Um, it's gonna be a busy and exciting day today. The kids have a half day of school. We had parent-teacher conferences yesterday. They're out of school tomorrow. So uh, this week has been an exciting one. Um, if if you're not a part of following our Instagram, just at Scotty Hobbs, there's a couple of fake accounts, but mine is at Scotty Hobbs. Um, you can see all the exciting things that are going on in our lives right now. Uh, we just um, got an offer accepted on a vacation rental home in Salt Lake City, so we're excited to, to be able to manage that home and have some fun with that. Uh, that's where Gabby's originally from. We also, I also ordered for the medical benefits, I'll be sharing my journey with that, um, a infrared um, sauna. Uh, it's it's going to be absolutely awesome. It's like light chromotherapy supposed to have some amazing and incredible health benefits. So I'm gonna be sharing uh, kind of my journey with that. Every single day, one of the things that's a part of my ritual is I do a 15, 10 to 15 minute guided meditation every single morning and I've been doing it in a hot Epsom bath every single day. Uh, I'm gonna switch over to be doing that inside of a sauna uh, for the health benefits and then uh, as part of my, of my morning rituals. It's gonna be quicker and faster than filling a tub and doing that thing. So. I'm excited about that. Uh, it's like uh, where you or you can't wait for it to get here. I placed the order yesterday, so I'm excited for that to come. Uh, but aside from that, it was day 48 of legs today. Uh, hey, I see all you guys hopping on here. I was uh, scared to do this workout. I pushed, uh, <laughs> I pushed snooze on my alarm. I actually reset my alarm for later in the morning. Uh, about an hour and a half after the original time, and and I laid there right after I did that, and I was like, no. No, what am I doing? I've got to get up. I've got to do this. Uh, and I wasn't looking forward to leg day. I have been throughout this program, but today particularly I was not. And it's because sometimes in life we're scarred or uh, uh, we have this slight emotional damage or whatever from things that have happened in the past. So exactly one week ago today, uh, 15, 20 minutes into the workout, I had extreme lower back pain because I got that nasty knot in my right butt cheek in my glute um, when my legs got tight and it pulled on my lower back and caused immense pain. That put me on the floor. I was using some pain meds later that day. I got a massage that day to try to work it out. Uh, and I've pretty much got it all worked out and fixed. But like I was going into that workout today, like, huh, oh my gosh, I'm gonna strain some. My leg's gonna get tight. I'm gonna get strained. I'm gonna have back pain. I don't want that. Um, and I, those were all my thoughts as I as I went into the journey this morning. Uh, but I had to push those out and say, no, today's a new day. Um, I logged in. It was a 40 minute workout. I had 60 minutes to get my workout done and be ready to get the kids up on time for school. So I took 10 minutes to lay on the floor and really stretch deep and get warmed up. After I got stretched deep and warmed up, then I did the workouts and it was a 15 set. Um, my son's here. Do you want to say hi in the video? Oh, mommy needs me. So mommy needs me. So we're going to go in just a minute. I had someone tapping on my leg here. So, um, I had to do uh, some extra stretches. I got into my workout, uh, and then after the workout, I did 10 minutes worth of stretches um, on top of the stretch that's already in there as well. So remember to listen to your body, um, take it light and modify. That's what I did today. I went lighter this time than I did the previous week, and then because I went lighter, um, I really focused on maintaining proper form, which we should always do, but even sometimes I forget that. So focused on proper form, slow movements, I didn't try to rush it, and I feel really good coming out of it today. So that's my day 48, I'm super excited. Um, we have our next test group starting, and the participants have looked at their meal plans, they know what plan they're on, and many of their packages are arriving this week. So I'm super excited about that, uh, and they're gonna crush it, just like you've seen the people in our test group right now, crushing it, and, uh, my message to you guys today is a simple one on leadership. It goes like this. Um, leadership is not you live in my kingdom, so uh, it's your duty to serve me. Leadership is you live in our kingdom, so it's my duty to serve you. I want you to think about that in leadership roles. That's inside your job as a parent, as a spouse, or running a business. You can apply that either way. Um, love you guys. Have an incredible day. See you guys tomorrow on day 49. I got to go see what my wife needs help with, and peace.